Hey everybody, Jeff with Cover the Camper. I'm just going to do a really quick video answering a couple questions that I had on my last video regarding the camper jack system. All right, so here's a really quick simplified explanation on how these Atwood camper jacks work. Uh, so you've got four corner jacks, remote control, uh, you've got the uh, activation switch, and then you've got the polarity controller right there where all the jacks are wired into and the 12 volt connection to the batteries are. Um, so you've got, in order to make this remote control work, uh, you know, it's kind of like a safety feature. I can push these buttons and nothing happens. And they, they do that just, you know, for the main reason, so you don't accidentally, you know, raise or lower your camper jacks uh, if something smashes the remote control going down the road, or if you're actually, uh, you know, staying in the camper off the truck and maybe you throw something on top of the remote and it, you know, lowers the jacks and then, you know, potential uh, accidents could happen that way. So they put in an activator switch. Um, this is an activation switch. This is uh, the new switch that I just put in to replace the old one. Uh, same switch, same functionality. So you push this button here, it activates the system, which allows you to run the remote control. And the remote control actually talks to this polarity switcher in here. So you've got your data cable, this gray cable right here, that connects back to that activation switch that's by the door. Um, this red wire right here is the antenna for the remote control. So the remote control can talk to the switch. And then all those wires across the top are the wires that come in from the individual jacks on the uh, on each corner of the camper. So uh, you've got your uh, front right, front left, rear right, rear left, uh, all wired in there. So that's basically how that system works. Um, these two big wires um, here, uh, the white and the red, that's your uh, 12 volt coming from the battery. So your positive and negative coming from the battery, which energizes the system. Um, again, that's not going to work unless you activate the system with that switch right there. So that's how that whole thing works. Um, basically, you know, just a, uh, a safety feature right there um, that turns it on and allows you to uh, run your remote control uh, for all your jacks. So with the remote control, you can, uh, this center switch, you can run all the jacks up and down or you can do individual, um, you know, one at a time if you need to do it that way.